All right, what up YouTube? This is Big Kenny G here again. And uh, this is gonna be kind of a response video to a uh, uh, video that Honest Reviews just posted. Uh, it's kind of an, a response, kind of an agreement video. Um, mainly because he got me paranoid and I'm actually looking for my BioLite right now. And um, before I pop that one open, um, I'm very much in agreement with him. I absolutely love BioLite products. I've got um, not tons of stuff from him, but I'm getting a little bit of a collection going. And this is the first one. I got this back in March of 2013. I actually just looked it up on the REI uh, website. You, if you have an account with them, you can look up your past purchases. So I bought that March 2nd, 2013. And I've been using it the entire time I'm actually doing, for those of you who watch my videos, I've been doing a review um, on, now that it's, you know, five years old, what it will still charge. Because technology has changed so drastically in the five years it's been out. It was probably able to charge just about any cell phone on the market at the time it came out. And now, yeah, not so much. <laughs> but it still works for some stuff and it's still pretty cool and I love it. So... Um, I use both my BioLite stoves quite a bit. I did get the camp stove too. And as you can see, where's the camera? I've not had the issue with mine, but I am looking at it just to see because he had it happen twice and he's got me a little bit paranoid about, um, about mine melting. So anyways, um, just a disclaimer too, I pay for all my BioLite products. I've got the kettle pot, I've got the kettle charge, which I did have one kettle charge replaced, um, and I ended up with two of them. I have, I just got the, actually it's the pack, it was the three pack of the BioLite lights. It was all the sight lights. So I'll have reviews coming up on each of those, what I think of them, I've actually been using them a uh, few nights when I'm off, I work nights, so it's hard for me to test those, but um, I had those all strung up the other night and actually lit up my entire driveway and my little mini man cave here and had that all going. So, um, but as you can see, I've also got, it's actually outside right now because I just used, I used it a couple days ago, um, but I've also got the grill, as you've seen from my other videos, for the BioLite stuff. Um, eventually I'd like to get the solar panels, I'd like to get the base camp, and I'd like to get their batteries because right now I'm using the Goal Zero batteries because I had already purchased those before, I purchased some of them before I realized BioLite had their own batteries that came out. Um, so anyways, hopefully those will be future reviews, hopefully I can get my hands on those because I'd love to try them and I'd really like to compare them because the two batteries from base or from BioLite, sorry, match the Flip 10 and the Flip 20 from Goal Zero. They're the same wattages, and the same amount of power, they're the same amount of power bank, but there's definitely some pros to the BioLite ones from what I've read online. Um, the fact that they can take a little bit of a splash and as long as they're still, looks like as long as they're still closed, they'll be just fine. Where the BioLite ones, if they get wet, they are toast because they are, have openings all over them. There's a little switch and there, there's, I don't know if these are sealed on this end. Under here, I don't think that's sealed. Um, so if those get wet, those are probably done. Um, but I would love to try some of BioLite's other products. I've had such a great experience with the ones I've got. But, again, Honest Reviews did make me kind of paranoid, so I wanted to create this video. <laughs> check it out, and check it out on camera to see if I've had the same issue. Um, I use my BioLite camp stoves about once a week or so to cook on, just to, for reference, and have not had any issues. So I've been lucky on that, and like he said, there's about a one in a thousand ish that have an issue so it's not too um 
not too common, but common enough for them to know about it. I definitely agree with them on their customer service is absolutely excellent. It is, there's a lot of companies that could take their plan for customer service and really use it and really use it well. I've worked for a few different companies and I have to say they've got the best customer service that I've ever had to deal with. So anyways, I hope you guys liked the video. I hope you enjoy watching them. Please give a thumbs up, please subscribe, and I will catch you all next time.